Prophet Samuel Abiara, the founder of Christ Apostolic Church, pays a condolence visit to late T.B. Joshua's wife, Mrs. Evelyn Joshua. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing today? To my returnees, thank you so much. And if this is your first time of seeing my video, please support me by smashing on the subscribe button. And please remember to put up the post notification bell. God bless you as you do so. My people, today's video now about this, our popular prophet, Prophet Samuel Abiara, the founder of Christ Apostolic Church, CAC. Pastor Samuel Abiara paid a condolent visit to the widow, Mrs. Evelyn Joshua, the wife of our late prophet, T.B. Joshua. So the man can talk, say, in they sorry, when be say, now, now in they come after the death of her husband. And he encouraged the wife, Mrs. Evelyn. He encouraged her, he prayed with her, and he tell her, say, make it not let the good work of late T.B. Joshua go in vain, that she should continue doing the good work, preach about love, humanity, everything when be say, a husband live behind, make it not die. The man, this our prophet, Prophet Samuel Abiara, he was even surprised to see where our prophet T.B. Joshua lived before his death. The man say he never see prophet like T.B. Joshua. His, his simplicity, his humility is one to the known. Like, see where he live, a old rich man like that. How big and famous was T.B. Joshua to be living in this kind of apartment. So he preached about the life T.B. Joshua lived, everything that the both of them look together in Christianity and so on. People took to the Instagram uh, uh, comment section and said, unbelievable, see his house, this man that can buy anything he wants. He won't, but he chooses a simple life. People were so reacting on the video after a uh, past uh, prophet Samuel Abiara visit his home. They were all shocked to see where T.B. Joshua and family are living. From this video, people now knew the kind of life T.B. Joshua had lived. His simplicity was too much, like he's really a man of God. He know they do anything when be say every other prophet they do, like buying private jet, living living an extravagant life. This man was so simple, preaching how to live, how to give, how to love, how to support one another, how to give to the needy. So, uh, uh, Prophet Samuel Abiara encouraged the wife, said the work when Prophet T.B. Joshua live for grand, he not go die. May they continue to the preach how T.B. Joshua teach them how to preach, how to do good to the less privileged, and so. He also encouraged the wife of T.B. Joshua, Mrs. Evelyn Joshua, to be strong and faithful in the work of God. And he tell the wife, say, make sure they eat, make sure they okay, make sure not listen to waiting people they talk. Say, T.B. Joshua is a true man of God because he had a counter with him. He see the work when T.B. Joshua they do, so he called him while he was alive, and from then, T.B. Joshua has been his spiritual son. He tell the wife, say, make sure not listen to waiting people they talk say God know why he called TB Joshua so soon he prayed with the family he prayed with the children and he encouraged all synagogue members to remain faithful to the work of God prophet Samuel Abiara is the only prophet Nigerian prophet that has paid a condolence visit to the wife Mrs. Evelyn since the passing away of her husband TB Joshua 
T.B. Joshua is the founder and senior pastor of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, located in Ikotun, Lagos, Nigeria. He, he passed on on the 5th of June, 2021. May his gentle soul continue to rest in the bosom of the Lord. So guys, leave a condolence message at the comment section for the wife, Mrs. Evelyn, and for the f entire families of T.B. Joshua, and to all members of the Synagogue Church of All Nations. May his soul continue to rest in peace. Thank you so much guys please if you have not subscribed to my channel support me by hitting on that subscribe button to my returnees i appreciate you for your massive love and support i will see you on my next video guys do have a lovely and beautiful weekend ahead bye for now bye